In this exercise, set five marbles touching each other on a ruler. Take one marble and roll it into the five. Just roll it in. I'm going to put my finger here so you won't see what, what will happen. But roll it in. You can try rolling it in slow. You can try rolling it in fast. Uh, but without you, without a finger here, just leaving the five touching each other on the ruler, roll one in. What happens? Specifically, how many marbles roll out? Then, roll two marbles in to the five. Same thing, but keep the two together, roll them in. What happens? Then try three marbles. Roll three marbles in. Oop. Keep the three together. Have the five all sitting together. Five will be like that. Roll in three. What happens? I want you to see what happens, so I'm blocking the marbles on this end. But when you do this, don't block the marbles. Just let them be free. See what happens. If you roll three in, what happens at this end? What happens as the number gets larger? If you roll four in, is there a pattern to what's happening on this end? What happens if you roll five in? Or even six in? Six into five. What happens? Can you see any patterns in the system? And then... Use Desmos. Make a graph in the in a, using a table as we've done before. Make a table. Uh, the number in will be the first column, typically x1, and the number out will be y1. Let's keep it simple, and just record the number in and the number out, uh, and see if you get a pattern on a graph. If we get a pattern on a graph, then there's a mathematical model underneath the system. Can you determine what that model might be? Remember, mathematical model means an equation that predicts what the system will do. If you get a shape on a graph, that's a sign there's a mathematical model. And so, you can, if you can find that model, you can then predict what the system will do. So, if you, by models, we mean linear equations, quadratic equations. Do you get a shape on a graph? And if you do, what's the math for that? If you can figure out that equation, uh, uh, that'll be uh, what you can report for this. Report back. What was it that uh, you saw? What was it that? happened in this system when one went in, two went in, three went in. The marbles are doing what they're supposed to do. The marbles are following a rule. Can you find that rule, that mathematical model, that mathematical rule that the marbles are following? One in, two in, and play with slow and fast marbles. What kind of patterns are you seeing? And for the... Uh, when you explore it with Desmos, keep track of the number in versus the number out in a table, which will plot as points on a graph, with the number going in being on the x-axis and the number coming out on the y-axis. And uh, we'll see what you find out.